So I was watching Peterbot recently and I noticed something inside his video settings that really caught my attention. Surprisingly, the number one Fortnite player in the world, running one of the best PCs you can build, is choosing to use DirectX 11 performance mode instead of the brand new DirectX 12 performance mode that Epic Games released almost two weeks ago with the new season. And it's not just Peterbot, even pros with less powerful setups like Shark are also sticking with the older legacy option. So why is this happening? In the settings, DX11 is now marked as deprecated, which suggests Epic may plan to phase it out eventually. But does that actually mean DX12 is the better performance option? Well, this is what I wanted to find out in this video, as since the start of the season, I've been watching the competitive space talk about these two settings, and there's definitely a pattern. It doesn't really come down to the CPU, since most pros are already on the best processors anyway. Instead, it seems to be more about the GPU they use. From what I've seen, most pros on Nvidia cards say the legacy DX11 option feels better. It usually gives higher raw FPS and less input delay, which is exactly what they've been used to for years. Whereas on AMD cards, they say DX12 performance mode actually feels a lot smoother overall. It gives more consistent frames and better 1% lows. So even if the FPS counter itself isn't higher, the gameplay feels a lot steadier. And that does make sense when you look at how both of these APIs work. DX11 is old, it's been around for absolutely ages, so the Nvidia drivers are super optimised for it. DX12 on the other hand is newer, it's much more modern, and it can take better advantage of today's CPUs and GPUs. So in theory, DX12 performance mode should perform better if you do have a more modern PC. PC. However, with the setting itself being so new, it's literally not been out even two weeks yet, it does look like it's got a lot of work to go. And it will do, it makes sense, that's why they haven't fully removed the old depreciated setting yet. When DX12 performance mode is at a level that the developers themselves are happy with, they'll go ahead and remove that older legacy option. Right now, you can't really blame the pro players for choosing that older setting. If the input delay feels a lot less for them, and they are seeing high FPS, they're obviously going to go with what feels the best for them after testing both. However, that's also why you shouldn't blindly copy the pros. You should go in-game yourself and test which setting works best for you and your PC specs. This is definitely the best approach until Epic again do improve the DirectX 12 performance mode setting. Update after update, they'll keep improving it and once it does become very stable, I think eventually we'll see every single pro player switch over to this setting. Until then though, I hope this video explained why you see pro players using an older rendering mode. If you learned something, please drop a like, subscribe, and check out any of my other videos that are on screen right now.